day three of lockdown in South Africa and the kids are eating us out of house and home. So I've decided that after all our bread has been finished, I was going to bake a loaf. We've got this cookbook, Springbok Kitchen. I think I bought it for Raymond oh, for Father's Day many moons ago. It actually is our go-to book. So we found the cheese and bacon muffins and we have no bacon and the butter is on rations. So we've changed it up a little and we're going to add some chives and rosemary from our garden. So far I've got self-raising flour, salt, two extra large eggs from our supplier down the road. There's a farm, caribou farm, and we get our eggs from them. There's a piece of onion in the fridge. I don't have bacon, so I'm using corn instead, and I've grated a bunch of cheese and stuck that in. So let's just chop up these chives. Now this could go either way. For those of you who have kids, and if they are fussy like ours, adding anything green, um, could either mean they're going to see it as food from the Hulk and enjoy it or toss it because they're going to think it's spinach. So we're just really being adventurous because there's nothing else to do. Do you think that's enough? Yes. Okay. I'm going to cut this rosemary up because the finer you cut it, the less chances they have of being able to pick it out. Let's stick that in. I guess you could probably grate up a zucchini or some carrots, add spinach if your kids are not as fussy as ours. Okay, so then here I've got the egg mixture and I've added some coconut oil because, like I said, the butter is on rations. One second. Mm. Is that your sanitizer? It is. <laughs> After, to keep your it's sanity. After three o'clock, just. <laughs> Lauren uses um, a different type of sanitizer, not hand sanitizer, <laughs> brain sanitizer. <laughs> Compliments of the cape. Stick that mixture in. Give it a good mix up. Okay, so we've left out the milk. 180 mils. Three of these. Heavy hand, just like my wine. <laughs> now, since I haven't really followed this recipe completely, and it's not muffins that I'm after, um, I got Raymond another gift, also Father's Day, which is this pot bread pot, which is pretty cool. Now, if this is a hit, then I could probably use leftover tomorrow morning and grate some more cheese over it. Toast it, grate some cheese over it and give them that for breakfast. Okay. I'm actually really excited just to have a little taste of this because I think it's going to be delicious. After this, stick it in the oven and start the bride. When I say start the bride, that'll be Raymond's job, not mine. So you stick that in the oven, 220 degrees for 10 to 12 minutes until the tops are golden brown. But because we haven't made muffins, I'm totally winging it and I will take it out when I can smell it because I think that's a rule. for now. Alright guys, it's been 45 minutes. The 15 minutes was definitely not enough. So we're going to give it a quick stab, see if it comes back clean. If it is, then it's done. Okay. Wow, Ooh. that looks amazing. Oh. Yeah, and it's ready. Gosh, that smells so good. If heaven had a smell, that is what it would be like. Okay, so we've loosened that it with a knife. Just give it a good shake. So that is our day three lockdown shakedown. This is what we're getting up to this Sunday. We're going to have this bread with lashes of butter. 
Raymond's made some cucumber um, pickle last week already. So we're gonna just do that, stick some meat on the braai, and um, we are very lucky. We've got musicians living in our neighborhood. So they have said at six o'clock, they will start playing some music for us. So just stay safe guys and stay home. One second. We have 35,000 of you subscribers out there that are watching our channel on a daily basis. And what we're appealing to you guys for is likes, comments, and shares. We have uh, quite a few of our primal providers in lockdown on farms, uh, myself with a dam in my, in my backyard, and we're able to punch out some, some content for you guys to keep you entertained in this lockdown period. If you guys would like to see that content, we want to see you guys liking, commenting, and sharing on all our videos. If we see the likes, the comments, and the shares start increasing, we're going to punch out a video every single day to keep you guys entertained. It's easy guys, it takes five seconds. Get on the bottom of the video, hit the share button and share it on all your platforms. If we get 20,000 likes on our videos, we will release one video every day of this lockdown. So get liking guys, get sharing and get liking. Guys, I look forward to uh, seeing some shares and making some content for you guys.